Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin for Gadget TV on Butterscotch.com, taking a look at Sanyo's Eneloop Cairo. Now what this is, it's a small rechargeable hand warmer, and you can get it for about 60 bucks. The model number on this one is K-I-R-S-E-1-S-W. Now you can see if I put my hand in the shot that it really is palm sized. It kind of looks a bit like an egg and it's, uh, it's reasonably thin. Now if we turn it on here, you can see it's uh, pretty simple, it's just the one power switch. You see here this is off, this is medium, and then this is high. So if we throw it into medium, it's a little hard to pick up on camera, but this uh, LED is actually glowing orange. Now if we flip it up to high, hopefully we'll be able to see that it changes to red. You can see it's maybe a little bit more intense. Uh, when you're actually holding the thing in your hand, you really can see the difference in the uh, LED colors. And now that it's on, I'll show you the back here, this metal plate is actually heating up. So what you can do is you can put it in a pair of gloves and just kind of hold it in your palm, keep you nice and warm on, uh, on cold winter nights. Now it takes about three hours to charge. On high, it uh, promises a battery life of one and a half to three and a half hours. Uh, on low, it's two to four hours. Now, these, this variation in battery life really comes down to ambient temperature. So it's very, if it's very cold outside, probably the exact time you'd want to be using something like this, your battery life will be cut. Uh, but if it's kind of a, a more mild day, say minus 10 or something like that, not that that's particularly mild, but uh, you'll, you'll get uh, closer to the higher end of that um, time scale. Now, if you have it on low, which was the orange LED setting that we showed you, you'll get up to uh, 38 degrees centigrade or 102 degrees Fahrenheit. If you have it on high, it gets to 42 degrees centigrade or 109 degrees Fahrenheit. So you can see it's not, uh, not hot by any stretch, but it is really a nice kind of hand warming thing to have. You just keep it in your pocket, and as you're kind of commuting about the city, you can uh, just kind of use it as you need to. Now, if we look on the bottom here, this is the uh, only port on the device. It's just a simple uh, power port. Over here, we have a place to attach a lanyard. There's no lanyard included, but uh, you can pick one of those up for just a buck or two. Now, you might think that something like this would charge via USB. Most uh, geeky gadgets like this do. However, that's not the case here. In the box, you get this uh, little power adapter. Now, it is a universal power adapter in that you can use it anywhere there's 120 or 240 volt service. So this little plug just goes in the bottom, and in about three hours, you're fully charged. So that's a quick look at the Antelope Cairo. For Gadget TV, I'm Andrew Moore Crispin. For more sweet stuff, visit butterscotch.com.